Hi, Carl. Congratulations, ha. <laughs> Salamat po. Sobrang ganda nung song. <laughs> Unang dinig ko, naiyak agad ako. <laughs> Medyo tiring. Uh-huh. Eh. Ayun. So, ikaw, ikaw lahat yung nagsulat nun? Or collab kayo ng banda? Uh, nasulat ko po yung song. Talaga. Pinagawa sa akin ni Boss. <laughs> right away, ah. <laughs> uh, parang ano po, t- t- Sinat niya ako ng madaling araw, ng, I think Thursday ng madaling araw. And I submitted it to him Friday. Wow. So, so ano, lyrics and and yung musika mismo sa'yo? Yes. But the the boys helped me out with the music. Uh, nag-record si Jax and RJ ng additional vocals and guitar. So, we're just very fortunate to have the ability to produce on our own. Um, so the the entire product that we released today is a collaborative effort with everybody. Na online, hindi kayo magkakasama. Wow. Pero lahat kayo nasa Bulacan ngayon? Yes po, pero dahil magkakaibang barangay po kami, hindi rin namin pwedeng kitain ng isa't isa kasi naka-lockdown po kami dito. May isang confirmed case in in our city. So mm-hmm. Only one person is allowed to leave the house, and may may window din kung ano lang pwedeng imalis. Tapos ano yun? Automatic na isip mo lang yung tahimik pero di pa yapa. Paano magkakaisa sa panahon? Malayo sa isat isa. Kasi ang ang ganda ng irony. <laughs> Actually, di ko po alam sa nanggal. <laughs> Masa like flow na lang po eh. When I when I sat down and tried to write. Uh, those were the thoughts that came into my head and parang ano, parang na-download lang from from the heavens yung, uh, yung mga lyrics. Uh, it's not something that I really um, tried to do or parang I wasn't trying to sound witty or trying to sound smart or poetic but I guess uh, that's just the natural feelings that I have that and they just kind of fell in the right place. Um, yun po. Pati yung music eh, as ang suabe, ang ganda, parang ano talaga. <laughs> Hindi sa, I'm not patronizing ah, ano lang, maganda talaga. <clears throat> it's, it's a gift But, from heaven. Parang gano'n you know, po siya nakita, parang it's like, uh, nalaglagin na lang dito sa harapan ko and all I just had to do is to write it down and execute it. Parang gano'n po siya. Oh, hindi ba yun yung tipong, uh, I'm sure medyo aware ka doon sa disconnect? Parang yung medyo may kaya, iba yung pag-handle ng situation, ng lockdown, ng quarantine, ng COVID. Mm. Tapos, pero feeling ko mas tatamaan talaga nung kanta mo yung mga frontliners, yung mga kumakalamasik mura ngayon. Alam mo yung gano'n, yung talagang hindi na alam ko sa kakapit, no? I- ikaw, in particular, sa pag nagsa-social media ka, ano yung pinaka na tumatama sa'yo for you to be able to produce a... Um, like this. San ka tinamaan? Um, actually, ano po eh, uh, ang pinaka nag-strike sa akin before, you know, getting involved with with, with writing the song. Um, I, I read an article about doctors dying of the of the virus and it's just so ironic how you will run to doctors for help and even them can't help themselves anymore. Uh, and they're sacrificing a lot for the community, and yet no one really seems to have the answer on how you will get well. Uh, parang my my initial or or my general idea about the situation is, if you get the virus, uh, it's always fifty fifty. If the symptoms are are uh, severe, you die. If the symptoms are relaxed, then you're fine. But there's no way of knowing, and parang as of today there's still no proven cure so um there's a sense of hopelessness and helplessness that i felt like even the doctors can't heal themselves and i, I saw an article where a doctor said she's scared uh, and she hasn't felt scared like that and this is coming from a doctor who's uh who probably has the best knowledge of what to do so imagine what and and you know I, I i all of a sudden felt 
afraid. Um, even while while writing this song, I went through a bit of a, an anxiety attack uh, because just the feeling of Lord, what's what's the solution? There's there seems to be no solution, um, and that's that's I guess that's where Manalangin came out from. Like the the when there's nothing left to do, all you really could do is pray, um, and. It's it's funny how a guy like me going through anxiety, uh, experiencing panic attacks would be actually able to write a song about hope and about praying and about uh, declaring that matatapos din tong dilim na to. Um, and yeah, I guess it's 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 trying to be a light in the midst of darkness. Yun po. Bali, yun na ito yung kanta na natin mo. Parang message mo sa mga hopeless ngayon. Yeah. yeah. Uh, actually, ang amazing po sa kanta na to, uh, so, nasubmit ko po siya mga Friday kay Boss. But, Sunday, uh, the Malacanang announced for uh, a week of prayer. So, parang meron pong order from Malacanang announcing that this week will be a national week of prayer where even the government is encouraging people to pray. So, uh, for me, grabbing, sobrang amazing lang na after writing a song, after two days, here comes the national government encouraging everyone to pray. So I really felt in my heart that, you know what, maybe we're supposed to release this right away. Maybe this is a message that people uh, will be able to connect to and maybe this can be a resounding uh, message for everybody to really take time to pray for our country and pray for the people that are you know going through suffering um, going through lack uh, worrying um, and this this virus is not just claiming people's lives it's people's lives it's claiming people's uh, mental health especially for, for people who are vulnerable to anxiety uh, panic attacks ako hindi naman po ako tao Siguro lang, I needed to go through that so that I could write the song. Because right after, say yesterday we finished, I finished the masters last night. Eh. After that, okay na ulit. Kasi tapos na eh. Tapos na yung project. Tapos na yung gagawin. Um, but I, I guess, uh, I, I had to go through that. Kasi po, I'm, I'm living a relatively comfortable life. I mean, you know, my mom cooks. I'm in my room. Comfortable naman po yung buhay namin. But I guess... Uh, the reason why I had to go through anxiety and panic attacks the past two days is because um, I just needed to feel what other people are going through, maybe even worse, uh, and hopefully connect to that feeling and let people know that they're not alone in this battle. Um, uh, obviously, you remain creative and impactful kahit naka-lockdown kayo or naka-quarantine. Uh, but ano pa yung ibang mga ginagawa mo to keep sane, to keep moving, you know, kayo? Um, uh, actually, po, there's a lot of work on our end. Um, we're editing a lot of videos. We're creating a lot of material online uh, because... Uh, well, sabi nga namin, may dalawang option in this time of crisis. Either to be paralyzed by fear or uh, to move and act in faith. So, what we're doing po sa Dahuans now is we're trying to create as much content as we can. Uh, we're trying to stay active and engaged online because we believe that the platform and we believe that uh, whatever it is that we have in our hands, the internet, the reach on Facebook and YouTube, uh, we can still use that doing what we do to keep sharing our music, to keep sharing our art. Uh, and uh, yesterday, we had a meeting. Actually, parang every day, we meeting kami ng the Hawans online. Uh, and we just, we're just, we, we're trying to keep ourselves occupied with what can we do at this time? Because we don't want to, we don't want to waste time uh, sleeping around or eating or I mean, of course, we, we do that, but uh, we try to relax and also, you know, get a, uh, a bit of rest. But at the same time, uh, we believe that we're positioned at this time for a purpose. 
and ginagawa na lang po namin lahat na mga kaya namin so that we could maximize whatever it is that's in our hands. Um, we're very blessed to have the ability to produce our own songs, our videos uh, together. So uh, I think few days ago we did parang an online jamming where we we took videos of of all of us individually and tried to put that together in one video so people would, would see that we're jamming together virtually. Um, in short, uh, in, uh, I mean, cut the long story short, we're trying to utilize everything that we can uh, to make good use of this situation and to still, to still bring inspiration to the people uh, regardless of how uh, restricted we feel because, you know, no one can really uh, get out of the house as of this moment. So, may kasunod pa to. <laughs> itong uh, impromptu impromptu inspiring song na to. Hopefully po, hopefully uh, we can keep on writing songs but uh, we're trying to really get in that zone of songwriting um, pero kung because people know us na puro hugot puro heartbreak um, but that's just the surface parang that's just the tip of the iceberg like if you really dig deep down uh, our, our foundations would really uh, point towards inspiring people, point towards relating and connecting to everyone. That's it, Carl. Maraming salamat sa oras mo. And, um, Thank you. Din. Keep writing. <laughs> okay po. Ingat po kayo. Keep safe po. Okay, okay po. Bye-bye po. Have a great day. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you po.